Hello guys, Hookah Brothers, this is Kuya Ando, I'm back and then uh, before we start review this, uh, reviewing this Ukuma reel, the one I have on my table, please subscribe on my YouTube channel, Hookah Brothers Fishing, subscribe, like and share the video and if you have time you can make a comment and we can, uh, I can respond to you guys and we can chat and give you some uh, information and uh, ideas too on our YouTube channel and we have Facebook and Instagram too and uh, today we have I have a uh, new Okuma Alejos and this is a two-speed liver drag reel okay and I have uh, five Alejos five two this is a two-speed and it's very nice this is a second uh, uh what they call it next to the uh okuma makaira yeah this is a replacement from uh the andros if you remember we have okuma andros i think they stopped that one to produce that one and they replaced this kind of fishing reel and they name it for okuma alejos 5 and uh okuma alejos 5 and they have like 12 i think they have 16 and they have a lot of model and the, the range of this uh, Okuma reel is 589 to 539 and depend what model you're gonna have and this is one my second small one Alejos Pipe Narrow this is a two speed two and you have a big reel a big handle too and uh, we can review that one I don't know which one you like and this one is lesser uh, line and maybe like 300 350 lines in here maybe this one is 475 yards of braided let's see we're gonna check later and uh i really like it the way the one the way they do it put in here before i scratch it <laughs> and uh what you call this i really love the handle and the aluminum the one they did is very light compared to the Andros or maybe the rest of the uh, Okuma reels I like this one the bolt really in here some piecing reel I noticed that when you put this on the, on the rod and the, you, you make it this one tight I noticed some base of this one is uh, it's not really really top and this is a two, uh, two speed low gear and high gear low gear smooth really smooth and the high gear wow really smooth too and this is a uh, for the drag low and high okay if you can hear it and then there's a strike there and then you're not gonna make mistake place your drag there exact drag for your whatever you like tuna or yellowtail or uh, Dorado fishing set up your drag here and then if you need more power put that push that ball on there the black push it I don't know if you can see okay I think you can see it and push that one and then put it down there okay let's see my hand is too okay there you go and all the way there and pass that one in the back and there you go you can hear the click there and let's see okay before you adjust this one put this one on pre pre spool and then you can adjust this one let's see how smooth the wow it's so quiet it's so quiet and see the clicker here this is the clicker there you go and loud too it's loud if you're gonna do trolling you can use that one if you can use fishing and like a slow like slow like you need to chat with your friends put in a, on that thing and when you got hook up you can hear it nice and the good thing is they have uh what they call it uh this uh what they call i forgot what they call this control casting i think this is a control casting yeah 
and this kind of a uh, reel is uh, we can read some uh, information with this uh, this uh, redesign Alejo's two-speed liver drag reels are now reduced side load and heavy drag setting remaining lightweight compact body with big fish stopping machine build in a 60 61 t6 aluminum this is very good ultimate strength and a one-piece frame continues around to the non handle side and side plate which is cast control system that's the was cast control system that's the one and you know what i count how many click you're gonna if you can hear it okay we can start here one one two three four five six seven eight 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. I don't know how many, maybe like 50 clicks. Some uh, casting uh, control uh, reel, there's only like 10. This one is like maybe more than 50 clicks on that thing and you can control. That's the good thing with this. And this is not, uh, what I call it, this is not a magnet, magnet uh, control like the Abbott one. And the spool bearing is got our, our button to TSI oil and giving ultimate cast stability and pre spool. Alejo's reels is feature longer in 90 mm handle. This is the one, the oversized T bar. This is the handle, the one oversized T bar. And torque and clicker mechanism. That's the one, the clicker here. And the two speed shifting. This one, two speed. There you go low gear and high gear and uh, we can go down let's see what they have in here i hope i can try this uh this uh this year or maybe next year i'm planning excuse me i just ate i'm full and i'm planning to buy another two i'm gonna buy maybe like 12 and i'm gonna buy 16 and let's see i have uh I think I have been up. I have been a fishing reel, but I really like the style. And uh, this one is a five narrow. This is a five narrow. Five narrow braided line is capacity is 425 on 40 pounds braided line. 350 yards on 50 pound braided line. And the gear ratio is 641 and 381 on the slow gear. Okay. And retrieve niya, and retrieve, uh, sorry, the retrieve, line retrieve is 42 inches to 24 inch, and 24 inches. Maximum drag, that's the important one. 24 pounds, not bad. Same, same of Alejo's 5 and Alejo's narrow is the same drag, 24 pounds and then 15 pounds on the, uh, what do you call it? Uh, max drag is pressure is 24 pounds and maybe the other one is a 15 pounds have its last 15 pounds i'm not really sure for that and weight is 19 ounces not really really bad it's too it's really light really light if you want to change this one maybe we're gonna board lighter and uh, the alejos pipe uh, regular pipe this is narrow the one i told you about the line Alejo's pipe is uh, 475 for 50 yards and 310 yards for 65 pounds of braided. It's the same, 641, 381, uh, 42 uh, uh, inches, the same, 40, 24 pounds of drag, line retrieve is 42, same, 19.8 uh, ounces. And not really bad, it's too light actually, it's really light for me. And now, uh, I went to, I think I'm gonna check some more, I check some more, let's see what they have. Okay, and if you're gonna like it, I, uh, I recommend this one for this kind of piecing reel, maybe the small kind like the pipe narrow or the pipe one, pipe two, two speed is uh, good for Small tuna, yellowtail, and dorado. And dorado right now is uh, a lot. I think thousands of dorado everywhere. And everybody is catching dorado. And this one is good for dorado and yellowtail. 
and this is a carbonite du du dual pores drug system and uh, upgraded with Makaira thrust bearing and uh, 6 BB 1 TB corrosion resistant stainless bearings spool bearings featured TSI 301 oil or unmatched spree spool rigid one piece frame and uh, I told you 6061 um, aluminum frame and uh, anodized silent retrieval system the handle is over uh, the uh, what do you call or uh, nine, 90 mm handle arm increases cranking leverage power oversized T bar that's the one I'm talking about oversized T bar handle on all models and uh, prone cranking power lag and flag harness okay it's really 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 good uh, I never see uh, for last year I went fishing I never see Alejos on the boat yet and I want to try this I want to bring it to the boat and uh, I gonna go fishing and I hope next year I can pull blast using this one and I'm gonna buy another two for uh, size 12 and size 16 and uh, so far so good so far so good and and the one i like is the handle the oversized handle is two speed compact really really good it's not really really big kind of reel for yellowtail and uh, dorado small tuna this is perfect for you guys and i recommend this uh reel and please i have never used it just yet please uh give me some feedback on my youtube and let's see and uh if you try this if it's good or not give me some review on my uh give me some uh, information and uh, leave a feedback there on my youtube channel please i want to know some uh, information from you guys i know you guys are professional and i'm just a, a small blogger and still learning and i hope i can help you and uh, some information from this kind of reel and i really like it now and uh, i think this is like for my uh my uh, talika talika a talika 10 sizes like that and i love it the good thing is that look at this the handle oversized handle is really nice if you're gonna crack uh, if you're gonna cut big ones it's easy to crank it it's really kind of look at it in your hand how, how nice it is and it's very very good fishing reel good for casting if you like casting casting and casting late light bait any kind of lures of what this is good for you this is good for you I really love it I like the color too I like the color I like the color all the information some you put in here too yeah and whew, perfect okay guys uh, that's for now and uh, before I, uh, I went to uh, Bass Pro, oh Bass Pro, no, no, no. I went to uh, Turner, Turner is close to my place and I bought this one. I'm gonna put this one either here or this one. And I ordered in eBay, uh, I think from China. I ordered like 500 of these, 50 pounds and 500 of 80 pounds. I'm gonna put on my uh add the reel okay i bought this one and i bought uh, this one i'm gonna use this for my yellow tail i have a small one but it's a little bit this one is a little bit smaller than the one i'm using and uh, let's see and uh, the sad thing is i don't know every time i go to to <laughs> turn i need to buy something and i bought this one and uh looks good to me and let's see how it works this one is a little bit lighter it's a 300 grams let's see what we're gonna get okay this is a mustad rip rollers jig and this is a different style now different color different i hope can attract the tuna okay guys and that's it for now and i love you guys and god bless please brother don't forget to subscribe on my channel. Okay, God bless you. Bye.